we want you to keep food poisoning off your menu. And to help us out is the founding director of NutriFit and celebrity nutrition expert, Jackie Keller. Welcome, Jackie. Thank you. Thank you. It's a pleasure to be here. So everyone wants to know what we need to be aware of in the summer when we're preparing these delicious well, foods. You know, there's a lot of rules about summer barbecues and marinades and things like that. But some of the most important ones are to always, always lower the pH of whatever it is you're making by adding something that acidifies the the um, dish that you're preparing. Beer? Uh, beer. beer. Why that not? Was. Right? Why not? Beer. Beer. That's for drinking while you're barbecuing. That's for drinking while you're barbecuing. Finish off the bottle of wine that you start the marinade with by yeah. wine, yeah. beer, you know, lemon juice, lime juice, mm. orange juice, all of those make the uh, marinade more acid and that helps to preserve and protect Okay. Also, don't reuse that marinade because when you reuse the marinade, you're yeah. using the animal juices that are in it, and that's a definite no, no, no. Absolutely yeah. not. Mm -hmm. And the third and final thing is to always make sure that you separate the ingredients. You know, keep your your protein separate from your vegetables and things like that. Don't mix and match like that. Excellent. And what kind of recipes do you have here for Well, us? You know, awesome. I thought it would be fun just to do a little salad, a quick little couscous salad. It's something mm -hmm. healthy, whole grain, a little bit of vegetarian protein. Why mm. not? And then, great. you know, most guys love to barbecue great, chicken. Mm -hmm. So I thought a nice jalapeno chicken would be oh. a great Ooh, little lime. Like great. Great. So you, yeah, you ready to go? Yeah. Okay, well, you're going to help, right? Okay, yeah, yeah, so yeah. So we're yeah. going to make the couscous salad so first. What are the, what are the yeah. ingredients that you're going to be using? Well, let's go through them as we're adding. Cool. How's that? We'll do really quick. First, let's put the marinade on the chicken, and okay. then we'll make the couscous salad. So, okay. lime juice. Oh. Yeah, Maybe. a little bit of lime juice uh, on the chicken. This is the marinade. This is okay. Yeah. And then oh, yeah. you know, uh, some, some jalapenos mm. and uh, some uh, salt-free seasoning here. Yeah, this is a calypso blend that we oh. make, which Ooh, is just nice yummy. Yeah. You know, and if you leave this to marinate about 30 minutes, it's good to go. And now it's your turn. Okay. Pick it so up. This is yeah. Does that mm, work for you? That smells really good. So how good. are you at the okay. grill marks? Can, yeah? You want can me to flip it? I'll yeah, flip, flip okay, it. Okay, I'll just hold on. There we go. Right. See? Yeah, look Ooh, at look that. Ooh, look at that. Looking good, See? huh? See? So if you start that chicken in foil or something for about 20 minutes before you're ready to get the grill marks, you okay. can open up the foil, put it on the grill, get your grill marks, and you've sort of pre-cooked it a little bit so it cooks faster, the less time, the less exposure to heat, the less likely you are to give your you know, your guests something they didn't really want right. when they come home. But let's make a salad while that's cooking. Okay. Give it another minute right. or so and we'll be ready to, to, uh, to taste. Jump the gun, okay. Jim. Cool. Couscous salad. Couscous salad. This you know, is the couscous. This is the couscous, mm -hmm. which is a whole grain Excellent. and it's a great alternative to rice or potatoes or pasta. I mean, that gets kind of boring. Yeah. 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 yeah, we've already done the marinade. Yeah, we did marinade. Okay, so real quick now, let's put in some vinegar. We know that vinegar is going to help us sit up that's our vinegar. Let's give it a splash. Yeah, that's good enough. Well, you know, you can kind of measure or uh, use your eye. Okay. And about half as much oil as vinegar. Yeah. yeah. You know, this is the no mess method. You know, you use half as much of something, so you know you've got about the right proportion. That's good. Stop. Yeah. We don't. We don't need more oil than we need. Are you a cranberry kind of guy? Yes. Well, you, like you know, in certain situations, yes. All right, taste. Go give it a taste. Tell me if they're delicious. I think they're wonderful. You know, cranberries are great. They add oh, yeah. sparkle, mm. they add color. Antioxidants. And they yeah, add antioxidants. Good, good you. You've got that. Yeah, you so go for it. Yeah, you All bet. It. All of it. Make Just it dump easy. Dump it in there. You bet. Mm -hmm. that's, that's the kind of way I make a salad. You, go, you know, it's whatever I've got, it. I get it in there. And some onions, too. Just, yeah. So you can mix Ooh. onions and cranberries? Why what about not? These things? Sure. Did we do these yet? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Go ahead. That's Learn cilantro. It. Put it in. Oh, I love cilantro. Do can, you I just, know you, can I just have it? Yeah. You know no, what? It'll cleanse your breath, too. Yeah. yeah, it will. Ooh, you know, if you use all. a lot of garlic, but you, you want to have a lot of cilantro. cilantro. you put in there? Not that much, right? Put it in there, right? You don't. It's vitamin C. It's good for you. This is actually a good chelator. This actually will help with chelation. There you go. Well, go ahead and chelate away, honey All right. Now, some garbanzo beans, because we want to make a complete protein for the vegetarians that don't want the chicken, right? So, yeah, yeah. It's more like mint. Look how delicious that is. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? You'll notice I've been fairly quiet. Why? You're hungry. Well, I just can't wait to try this. Yeah. yeah. No. Okay. Well, we're just about ready. Drew? Oh. Ta-da! This is the final part. Ta-da! Yeah. You know, so how long would it normally take to make
make this meal? Please. You know, if you started the marinade and you got the chicken on the grill, by the time the chicken was done, 15, 20 minutes, you'd have the salad done, because couscous, you know, cooks in a second. It just cooks itself. And uh, so maybe 20 minutes, start oh, well. to finish. And voila. Oh, but of course, the proof is in the pudding, so mm -hmm. you want to give it a taste. Oh, this one's mine. That's yours. Mm -hmm. All right. So, you have a fork? Would you like a fork? I got you. Go. Okay. okay. I can just so, bon shall we? Everybody. Mm. Bon yeah. appetit. Bon appetit. Oh. Appetito. Now, do you make house calls? Mm. I do. Do you? Good. I'll come to yours you if you want to mine. We can, okay. we can do that. Yeah. A little this cooking Botox right. party. Yeah. Thank you so much, Jackie, for being My with pleasure. us. My pleasure. Delicious. Everyone here is going home with a copy of Cooking, Eating, and Living Well, as well as a gift certificate for a two-day free trial of NutraFit. Right. Very exciting. And if you'd like to find out more about Jackie's recipes, just go to our website, thedoctorstv.com. Coming up, summertime can also mean time for a lot of fried and fast foods. Find out some quick ways to keep your cholesterol down this summer.